Good morning, everyone. Alexis here. Thank you for joining me for our daily devotion and our morning prayer. Today, we're going to be coming from Acts chapter 9, starting at verse 18. It says, Instantly, something like scales fell from Saul's eyes, and he regained his sight. Then he got up and was baptized. Instantly, something like scales fell from Saul's eyes, and he regained his sight. Then he got up and was baptized. Lord, we just thank you for this word. We thank you for the Bible, God, because it is our God. It literally guides us, teaches us, molded us, and shapes us to what we need to be, God. Let us be able to follow your set of instructions, God, and do what you have outlined us for us to do. Let us learn. Let us be teachable. Let us be moldable. In Jesus' name, amen, amen, amen. All right, guys, so today we're going to talk about sight blockers. All right, so Saul, before he came Paul, he was on a mission to kill Christians, and he thought he was right. And sometimes we can relate to that. Sometimes we can be on a mission to do something, and we literally think we are right. Sometimes we can do different things, and we can have all the evidence to back it up. But the Bible also speaks about there is a way that seems right but leads to destruction. What does sight blockers do? It causes us to self-sabotage, meaning God had a his perfect will for us, but we mess up. We fall short. We end up going down the wrong road. We end up having to slow down. We end up delayed because we see a way that seems right but it leads to destruction. All right, what else does sight blockers do? It causes us to walk in the spirit of pride, meaning can't nobody tell us nothing. Can't nobody tell us nothing. We really need to be humble, but we can't see it because we think that we know it all. What else do sight blockers do? It causes us to do things out of God's will. So sometimes we'll be like, okay, Lord, um, I know that you're with me. I know I got grace, so your grace is sufficient. But literally, we can't see straight because we have these sight blockers on so basically we have a mission in mind we just go 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 and then we're like okay but god has to cause a disturbance he has to uproot us he has to pause us so that we can see really how god wants us to see so sometimes we don't even see it sometimes we need god to interrupt the pattern so we're going to ask god to remove any sight blockers in our life just like he did for saul and change his name to paul god give us a name change give us a new identity god give us a new way to do what you have called us to do so that's our thought for today Lord, we just thank you that you are changing our minds, changing our hearts, God. Remove anything that is blinding us. Remove the spirit of pride, God. Remove anything that is causing us to self-sabotage, God. We want to be more like you, God. We don't want to do our own way. We don't want to follow the way that seems right, but we want to follow the way that is right, according to your word, according to your promises, according to what you have called us to, called us to do. Lord, we repent today for self-sabotage, God. We repent today for walking and talking and getting our own way. We repent today for being the God of our own life, God. We repent today for looking at what we have and trying to make it work instead of looking to the Father, God. We declare and decree that you will shape us, mold us, and be the Lord of our life, God. We surrender today. We put our hands up, God. Arrest us, God. Arrest our sight and let us be who you have called us to be. Lord, we love you on today. We trust you and we declare and decree there shall be no more pride in our life, no more self-sabotage in our life God humble us today we are not always right we are not always right God we are not always right but you are your way is always right so we surrender today we love you we praise you in the mighty name of Jesus amen 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 y'all like this video subscribe to my channel and as always it's growing God I'll talk to y'all soon bye